Yeah, I'll, so, Coach Hard, what's your name? Roro Hyde. Roro Hyde, coming at your Hyde Science video over Law of Conservation of Mass. So it's an introduction video. Right here, what we have is a chemical equation. When uh -huh. hydrogen gas, right, the little g means gas, oxygen gas added together makes water. So these little symbols right here, right, they can kind of tell you, you know, G is gas, uh, AQ is aqueous solution, so it's in like water solution, L could be liquid, uh, stuff like that. So let's break down what we see here. So we got H2, so this is a molecule. You'll have two hydrogens bonded together. So it's one molecule, it's two things. The other one would be O2, which is two oxygens bonded together as a molecule. Then we get over here to water, which has two different elements in it, hydrogen and oxygen. And right, yeah. right. Hydrogen and oxygen, yeah. So we'll have an oxygen and two hydrogens. That's right. So this is a compound that has two or more elements in it. These are molecules because they are two of the same thing bonded together. Now, when we talk about conservation of mass, I understand two things, right, right? I do it. You do it? There's two sides of the equation. Right here where this arrow is, this is where the reaction actually takes place. So nothing's happening here, nothing's happening here. This is like the before, then the reaction happens, then this is the after. So the side over here, the before, okay, this is called the reactants. Are you leaving me? You are, where are you going? They're not going to see you no more. You got to stay up here. And this are the products. Law of conservation of mass says that there must be equal amounts of reactants, equal amounts of products. She's erasing the products. You can't erase the products. That's not part of it. Anyway, so. So oh, quit now. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Now you wet. What the? What's mine? Let me see that. Oh, puppy. So if we look at that, on this side, if we were to separate the reaction, we have two H2s, right? Oh, and a big and pink. All right, so we have four total hydrogens. We have two oxygens, or one O2, right? So we have two total oxygens. Now in here, it says we have two water. It's your turn? Yeah, that's good. Let me tell them, look, we have two waters, so we have a total of four hydrogens. And we have two oxygens. So on both sides, although it's differently, it changes phase, there's equal amounts of hydrogens and oxygens on both sides. Yep. Another way to look at this is mass. So let's say we had, you know, 10 grams of hydrogen gas, 20 grams uh, oxygen gas. So if we combine these together in the reactants, we have a total of 30 grams of mass. Law of conservation of mass says we must also have 30 grams of mass over here. So 30 grams. 30 grams total reactants, 30 grams total products. Good? We're good? We got it? You want my markers? Tell them bye. Bye.